So I just saw Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 and it was really good. Like, I absolutely loved it. I had a better time at this than I had at Wakanda Forever. I had a better time at the other, the only other movie that had a sorry about that. The only other movie I had a time this good in was No Way Home. I still say No Way Home is slightly better than this one. Um, a lot of that is nostalgia, I will fully admit. But this was awesome. The action was amazing. The characters for Adam Warlock was... He acted a bit stupid for being Adam Warlock. I'm sure we'll get a better and more wise take like he is in the comics. I don't know if he started out as stupid as he did in this. In the comics, I haven't read much with Adam Warlock other than, like, the Infinity Saga... Um, I don't, uh, I, Infinity Crusade, I think, is the one I, I read. Um, I'd have to double check, but yeah, no, it, it, it's not bad, though. It's just weird. Um, yeah, that, that, that slightly bugged me. Everything else was amazing, and the, the emotional stuff with Rocket was, was a lot. Um, a lot of the emotional scenes were a lot. And it did feel like a very proper closing. Although nobody died. It's it's amazing that nobody died. Uh, everyone I talked to was like, somebody's going to die, somebody's going to die. Nobody died. Everybody's alive. Now it does seem like they're going to go the Captain America route with uh, Drax and Nebula. Nebula maybe a little less. Um, especially since she has new, she has new abilities. Uh, but it might be a long while before we get anything more Guardians. Like, a long while. We have a new Guardians team, but that's about it. We'll probably see them Secret Wars. We're definitely at least seeing Star-Lord, because by the end of the movie, he is with his grandfather on Earth, and the incursions will be mostly on Earth. So, we're definitely... And not to mention, they said that Star-Lord will return. Um, yeah, no. And with Adam Warlock, we're definitely going to see him again. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm excited for the future of this, but this was a really nice wrap-up to the trilogy, and it was a great trilogy. Honestly, out of these, the only other trilogy that compares is probably Captain America. The Spider-Man movies, I love them, but trilogy, as far as trilogies go, Captain America is the best in the MCU, in my opinion. This one's a very, very close second. Um, I enjoy each of these movies, like, as my favorite, I love the comedy in them, but, um, yeah, I know, I'd say they're about an equal footing with the Captain America trilogy. I'm doing a lot of comparison here, um, but overall, the movie itself was amazing. The action is my favorite part. I'm, I'm gonna say that much. Definitely go and watch it. Um, I don't want to see too much, because there's a lot of elements that are really awesome I don't want to spoil. Um, I know I spoiled a lot in this already, and I'm not gonna be putting spoilers, Sorry, if you if you come across this, that's it's on you at this point. I'm I'm done with the whole putting spoilers and my tags because it dates the video. Uh, you can look at the date when it came out. If you want to avoid spoilers, don't be watching reviews. Uh, sorry. Anywho, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Amazing movie. Go see it.